Welcome back! We are playing more Undertale Yellow. We're going to the castle. That's all I remember. Huh? Hang on. I think someone's coming this way. Who could it be? Someone we know? Someone we know? Undyne's cousin? Guys, looky here. Someone new has stumbled into our humble town. This better not be another joke. These are all cool designs. Whoa, Knuckles the Echidna? Hiya, strangers. Oh god, Squirrelose. No one look up the rule 34. Don't do it! Please! That ain't a way to treat guests now, is it? The name's North Star. I run this town. Not alone, of course. There's no way your real name is North Star. I'm sorry, that's like your weeb sona, right? These fine monsters are my bossy. Together we are the Feisty Five. I'd be glad to give you and your buddy a door. Hold on, your buddy. Are they a human? I'm about to get all pieces. No! Well, I won't say no. I knew it. Ed, fetch me that kid. Oh, good God. I can and will report you to King Asgore for the surprise. Don't make me report you to my manager. <laughs> Shut up, we're playing cowboy. Let's go, bud. I kind of want to not jerk him off. I kinda... Look at this. Look at the cheese. Or is that a pyramid? He's the real one in charge of the town. He's the big cheese, if you will. <laughs> <laughs> North Star's the coolest. One time a construction team was demolishing a building in new home. But uh-oh, an infant was in the way of the building as it came crashing down. And suddenly North Star appeared and wound his lasso up. He wrangled that skyscraper without breaking a sweat. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! I think this might be misinformation. <laughs> I love spreading misinformation on the internet. Dude, this world's so in-depth. Oh, hello. You there, human. You okay? <laughs> Not really. Yes, put on a brave face. No one wants to hear about your problems. Really? No. No. Well, all right then. I'm afraid Star is going to drag you into his activities for a while. Smash. Uh-oh. Not in this good, friendly, Christian Undertale stream. We're gonna have so much fun training together. Hit, hit. I don't like that look you're giving me, Squirtle. I need an adult. Get away from me. Ah! I thought we'd start with a classic game that involves pacing. Is that like edging? Oh my god, it's Dummy Undertale! It's Dummy Undertale right there, guys! Let's see what you got. No, I don't want to shoot Dummy Undertale! Do I actually have to kill this guy? Oh, it's just a really visually complex shooting game. It definitely passed this part of training. I gotta go tell Saroba about this. Oh, hey, I almost forgot about the hat. I have a spare somewhere in my house. Clover, wait here while I fetch it. Maybe while they wait, you should get to know them, Saroba. Oh god, I don't want to go on a blind date with the dog lady. This whole thing is like a dream to him. You wouldn't believe how much his parents talk to me about it. And the corn they grow? So good. They used to give my husband a chujin- Oh, she's married. Sorry, guys. Sorry to destroy your hopes and dreams, chat. Turns out I had one just your size and in the same color. You got a nice hat. <gasps> Oh my god, it's like night and day, dude. Put up the before and after of Clover, please, because it's... They fixed his entire look. Star, what is happening on the west end of town? Is anyone in danger? Well, no, probably not. They are! By George. This must be an attack for vengeful Virgil. Virgil? Devil make right, Virgil? You sure you saw something troubling here? Look down. <gasps> Holy shit, what did he do? I'm afraid he must choose which track the train travels. No, not the trolley problem. You gotta choose now, Clover. Oh, uh, oh, uh, Knuckles can tank it, but I don't know. We're saving Knuckles. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry, I'm not pulling it. No, no! Ouch. You owe me for this. See, only the squirrel got hit. That was the good ending, guys. Ah, Clover likes me more. Anywho, I'll see you at the usual spot, kid. Come to me when you're ready for the final mission. Don't hold it against me, guys. So, Clover, I actually tricked you. There is no fourth mission. Fail there used to be, but we cut it out of the regiment. Anyway, you passed everything. You are now the proud deputy of this fine town. Wait, deputy? I thought this was for a normal spot on the team. Clover's too special and skilled for a normal spot. Star, this is hardly fair. Life ain't always fair in the wild east, bucko. <laughs> I have to run to the mines to get Clover's badge made. You five have fun. I'll be right back. No, please. Dad, they're gonna kick my butt. We had to go through weeks of lasso lessons. Lassons for short. Yeah, and he made me pit pocket monsters by the oasis. Starting to make you do that. <laughs> that was the ugliest laugh ever, dude. Feisty Four, here we come! No, they're gonna beat me up! So you're the new deputy, eh? Then you shouldn't have a problem dodging this! Oh, shit! What the fuck am I supposed to do about that? It comes it comes up first and I can fucking figure it out! Okay, you gotta stay at the bottom. What is this? Ah! Okay, ran right into it. Oh, wait, bottom, 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 bottom. Gotta be a bottom. Gotta be a bottom just this once. Oh, no, they're doing team attacks now! Dude, this is sick. 
Uh, no, there's no room anywhere to dodge. That's a Get ready for my strongest attack. Hey! Oh, man. What in the actual gosh darn tarnation is happening here? We felt your training was lackluster, so we gave Clover a real challenge. I'm disappointed in you four. Star, what's going on? You've been different. I miss the old North Star, the fearless leader. This new star is selfish and reckless. Or should I call you by your real name? Should I? Star Low? <gasps> Why you? It seems my posse don't respect me no more. I resigned from the Feisty Five, okay? It'll still be the Feisty Five without you, so you go ahead. No. No. I'm leaving too. I don't want to work under a big-headed sheriff. Seems like life dealt you a bad hand, Star. I'm following them. Feisty Three? More, more screen time for everybody. Sorry, Star. Please work on yourself. Forgiveness is only one apology away. Feisty Two. Sure. Fine! I was considering firing you all anyway! Soroba, you understand, right? They're being ridiculous. Starlow, they're right. You have changed a lot from the monster I once knew. This Wild East thing has damaged your personality. I want to see the real Starlow. That's a North Star to you. Oh no. Everybody's left North Star. At every turn, I tried to cheer Soroba up. I just wanted Kanako off of her mind. Hold on. This all happened after you showed up. Whoa, dude, hold on. Slow your roll here. Let's face facts. I couldn't keep you here forever, kid. Word would have gotten out that Feathers hadn't clocked in eventually. Royal Guards like her have a ton of status. They gain that status by doing the King's work. I'm sure. I'm sure everyone would come back if I did the same. Don't, don't make this difficult for me. Just hold still. Ah, Daddy, no! Oh, shit. He bound and gagged at me. No, no shooty. Not happening. Please, this is the only way to fix things. The only way I know is with extreme violence. Oh, shit. I guess I was stupid. Oh, dude, this is tricky dicky. Nope. Oh, shit. He's actually trying to shoot me now. Stay still. I don't want to hit my lasso. Oh, I get it. Whoa, you big dum dum, I'm free! Whoa, dude! Is isn't this McCree's old from fucking Overwatch or something? I don't know, I don't watch porn. Starlo, are you trying to kill a fucking child? Stop this right now. Who have you become? Because this sure as hell isn't the Starlo I grew up with. I was trying to provide a slash to the surface where we have none. There's nothing wrong with that. And I'm not even telling you to quit running the town. Just don't let this identity consume you. It isn't healthy. Very well. Clover, I'm terribly sorry for attacking you. Give me your hat. Oh, <gasps> this is who I really am. Oh, he's like, he's like, he's playing the Alphys or something. He's a nerd. Nerd. <laughs> Let's fucking kick the shit out of him. There's a pressing matter looming over me. Let's go to the old Steamworks gate. We'll speak there. Clover, Clover! Oh, fuck, who let her out? Since the imprisonment took up so much time, I have to go back. If I don't at least clock in, the Royal Guard will grow suspicious. So Robot encouraged this decision, so don't worry. She told me she would accompany you on the journey to Hotland. Oh, neat! So, the steam works. Jesus Christ, that's intense. You see, Clover, Kanako is me and Chujin's only child. I know how tough you are. You can move past this, I'm positive. Children dying ain't that bad. I just tried to kill this kid. There's no need because she's alive. That's a twist! Clover, you may not know this, but there's a lab in Hotland. An inquiry for the fallen to- Uh-oh. <laughs> How do you feel about your kid being, like, two or three people simultaneously? Stay close by and we'll reach our destination soon. Starlo left me in charge. Holy shit, she's fast. That's unnecessarily quick. Keep up, Clover. We don't have all the time in the world. Man, you're mean. You're mean. There's some kind of console here. Like an Xbox? If you want to chew Jin's codes will work. Just give me a sec. In the meantime, you can wait over in the corner or something. Dude, she's so mean out of nowhere. Okay. I'm going to go have my own adventure. You could be all mean on your own. Don't worry, I'll actually take care of business here. I did that? What? <laughs> I, was, I knew what I had to do, but I was just pressing buttons pretty much at random. I'm not going to lie. I think I'm getting some... Oh, yeah. just became my least favorite character right there. Uh-oh. Whoa. And it's not even a puzzle or anything. She says, I did it. If she says anything like, I did it, it's an instant genocide run. I wasn't actually doing anything this whole time, was I? Uh, alright, you're clearly more capable of problem solving. I suppose you should lead the way from now on. Just head west from here and we'll reach Hotland eventually. She just saved her own life and she has no idea. Oh my god. Axis model 014, ready to guard and protect. 
I am the last of my kind to police this area. All of my comrades have rusted over. I always knew I was the best, but I am also lonely now. Oh well. My husband, Chujin, used to work here. I have permission. Chujin, my creator? Sorry, I do not see him present. Goodbye. Oh no, wait! Delta Rune reference? I knew my husband was an engineer, but he never told me about that guy. I would have used force to bypass Axis, but I, I'm not sure now. Dude, why is she so violent? <laughs> he may be the last remnant of Chujin's talent. I have an idea. He mentioned how he was lonely, right? Well, what if we fix that? We could use scraps lying around to forge a companion for him. What do you think? Yes. Great. Oh my god. The bow tie goes there? And the stereo, it locomotes, I guess, by, like, blasting fat tunes, dude. It bounces it up in the air. How do we get out of here? The vent. Oh my god, guys. We're venting? I'm unfollowing because of that. Worth it. I'll do it again. <laughs> I'll fucking do it again. <gasps> Escape convict spotted. Steamworks office branch. Oh no, run. Why don't we just let our robot go? Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh god, I hate that. No, please don't combo me! What's he doing? The reads are insane! Axis, hold on a second. Okay. One. Uh, one million seconds. I do not have the knowledge to count that high. Same. He's the most relatable character. I have for you your very own robot companion. A sleek, top-of-the-line model. Aren't they beautiful? No. Not in the mood. <laughs> what a fucking chat! Well, it was worth a shot. Plant C it is. <gasps> no, fuck you, why? <laughs> oh, my baby boy. <laughs> I have to protect him. I hope you have a lovely rest of your morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are. I love you. Bye-bye, y'all. Yeah.